What are the things we value most about our modern world? Freedom. To enjoy ourselves. To argue and discuss. To express our views. To find things out. To read and write. And the science and technologies that make these possible. None of this happened by accident. These freedoms were won through courage and with vision in an extraordinary period of human history. It began in 17th century Europe. It was called the Age of Enlightenment. In the space of little more than a century, religious faith yielded to reasoned argument. And the power of aristocracy gave way to the power of knowledge. But it was a hard-won battle against the fierce opposition of a powerful church and ruthless monarchs. It laid the foundations for the modern world. In this program, we tell the story of four great Enlightenment innovators. Isaac Newton, who opened up knowledge to everybody by inventing modern science. Denis Diderot, who challenged the church's monopoly on knowledge. The Marquis de Pombal, who built a modern city for the people of Lisbon. And Erasmus Darwin, whose discoveries deep underground mounted a direct challenge to the church's claim to truth. Our story of the Enlightenment begins in England in the late 17th century with Isaac Newton. He was the founder of modern science, which was to become the single greatest challenge to the power of the church. At the beginning of this period, most people's lives were based on obedience and belief. They obeyed the church, which told them to obey the king, who, it said, had been chosen by God. People believed what was in the Bible, not what they found out for themselves. <laughs> 